This is on factoring. The first example is repeated factorization. So we can factor this example first by the difference of two squares. We can change that x to the fourth to x squared raised to the power of 2. We can change that 81 to a perfect square of 9 times 9, which is 9 squared. Now that'll be the difference of 2 squared, x squared minus 9, and x squared plus 9. And now notice this first parentheses is another difference of 2 squared. So it can be x minus 3 and x plus 3. And then we have x squared plus 9. The next two examples are working with uh, perfect squares and they're perfect square trinomials. So the rules are if you have two perfect squares on the outside of a trinomial, then the inside is produced by 2 times a times b. So let's look at this first example. This is your a term. So that's x squared. And then this is your b term plus 3 squared and then we can go ahead and just change that to the rule a plus b so x plus 3 all squared. Um, second example has the a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. Notice that the sign is going to be the same. So here is our 25x squared as a perfect squared. It's going to be 5x times 5x or 5x squared. This is your perfect squared of 6 squared. So be careful on the sign. It's going to be in the rule 5x minus 6 all squared.